Hi everyone, it's Logan here, and just bringing you an update. Um, so, here's where we're at. Uh, Go-Kart is done. It's completely finished except for one thing, and that's the upgraded batteries. So, if you remember from my last episode, um, I was going to do an upgrade path. So, I was going to start with just this battery pack, a jumper pack, which is a 12-volt pack, and then eventually upgrade to 24 volts. Well, I was off a little bit. Uh, I thought maybe I would get, you know, 5, 10 miles an hour out of this. Well, I was off a little bit. But I wanted to show you everything's working. I found the problems. One of them was a loose connection. Uh, so, I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. So, lights up, everything's going. Turn the switch on. And now I'm going to hit the pedal. I love that. So, now that looks pretty good, right? It's up on a block here. It looks like they're spinning pretty um, however, there's a problem in that they don't put out as much torque as I thought they would at this voltage. Now, I don't think it'll be a huge problem in the end, but we're going to go ahead and drop that, and uh, you're going to see what happens. I'm not going to sit on this. I'm just going to push the pedal. Yeah, so it's a little bit underpowered. It, I think I had it up to about five miles an hour without me sitting on it. So obviously there's some changes that have to be made. However, I did buy the 24 volt battery pack. Uh, actually, I bought individual cells that are going to be 24 volts uh, from a Chinese supplier. They're going to be arriving shortly. They're already uh, on their way. But I also bought more than enough cells. So I may, the upgrade part of this that I promised, may end up being, instead of 24 volts, maybe 36 volts. And what I'll probably do in that case is actually tear the motors apart and add a thicker wire so that I don't burn out, burn out the motor windings. But um, that's the update. It is physically functional, um, but there's still some work to do. So as soon as those batteries arrive, uh, I'm going to have to manually solder them all together. and may even make another video about that, showing you how to do that. But um, that's where we're at now, and I'll be bringing you another video here in hopefully within just a couple of weeks once I get that working. Thanks for watching, and uh, don't forget to subscribe and check out my other videos, and of course, have a great day. We have All I have to say is, missile. oh yeah. That went right there. Does that not look awesome? <laughs> oh. So it's obviously not entirely finished. I have to get another one of these on the other side, but that's cool. I'll have to cut these off. This side's gonna be a little bit tougher to do because 